be vlogging. I am in my new room. Ah! If you haven't seen my spring room tour, you totally should. I love my room, so I just woke up. I want to vlog today. It is like literally one o'clock. We stayed up till three last night, me and my mom just talking. So that's what it's like being homeschooled. You know, you get to you get to do that type of stuff. Today on the agenda, I have to edit a room tour that will be posted by now, so you guys can totally check that out. This vlog is filming. I'm posting this Saturday, but I'm actually filming it on Sunday. I have some editing to do. I'm getting ready for my tech week because I'm in the show Willy Wonka. And I'm one of those grandmas that sits in the bed. It's so fun. So we're having tech week tomorrow. Yeah, I'm in my bed. I don't have a whole lot to do today. I just wanted to vlog because, you know, I like posting four times a week for you guys. And I know y'all love the vlogs. All right, first thing that I like to do in the day is make the bed. <laughs> Y'all, last night a nail fell off, but they stayed on for a whole five weeks. So I do this thing where I take thumbnails that are like done and they're on my desktop and I lower them and put them side by side and make sure they all match. I think these two match really well, so this is the vlog that went up Wednesday or Friday, I can't remember, and then this is the room tour thumbnail. So they look good together, so yes. This is the official room tour thumbnail. Breakfast time, I'm gonna have a green apple, and a Pop-Tart, cause you know, staying healthy, eh? <laughs> Food is eaten, sun is shining. I was just talking to my mom about scheduling stuff. She's basically my manager. Like she does a lot of, of like planning with me and stuff like that. So I think I'm gonna go outside and tan. I have my schedule written out for this week, which makes me feel super good and organized. I got my swimsuit from Justice. Comment down below if you want me to do like a try on bikini haul. I think that'd be like really fun. Like maybe like a summer one. I don't know, I think that'd be really fun. But every day I've been going out and tanning, so I'm getting a little bit tanner. Which I'm obviously really happy about. All right, see you guys in an hour. Okay, so I'm done tanning. Um, I didn't go for as long as I expected just because it's a hot day, but I saw this little DIY thing and it was like how to clean your makeup sponge. So I have two right here. Okay, so basically you put some dish soap into some water and then you're supposed to put your beauty blender in it and then you put it in the microwave. Okay, I did it for 20 seconds. Okay, in the video, their, their like water turned brown. I don't think it works. <gasps> oh my gosh, did you see all that brown stuff come out? <gasps> Whoa, it kind of worked. What? You can't really tell because it's black, but it got a lot of it out. I'm really surprised, look at that. Okay, this one was a lot harder to get it out, but look at that, I just had to squeeze it. Oh, I had to squeeze it a whole lot, because this one's from Claire, so it's not as squishy and nice as the other Beauty Blender. Um, but it's clean. I know you the more I want to. Yes, nothing inside me I was so much younger yesterday. Oh, I didn't know that I was so and took an Instagram so I have my hair. Oh, it looks kind of bad right now. Q&A time! Okay, so a lot of y'all asked me, like a lot, pretty much every comment was like, what do you want to do when you're older? Or where do you want to live when you're older? So I, I, I don't know, I don't know, because I feel like whatever I say, I'm gonna change my mind in like a month. Um, but the first question is, where do you want to live when you are older? Um, I haven't really thought about it, honestly. Like, 
I, when I first went to Chicago, I wanted to live there because it's so pretty and it, I love the cold weather. But now I feel like I want to live somewhere more beachy. I've recently been loving laying in the sun and being all warm. So I really don't know. Like, I'm, I don't like to think about too head, too far ahead. Like, I know all my friends had their baby names picked out, but... I haven't thought of any because I know I know I'm gonna change my mind. What is your dream vacation? I don't know. I feel like I really want to go to Bora Bora because I said <laughs> recently a bunch of YouTubers went on a trip and it was so pretty. And I don't know. I feel like that'd be super cool. And it's so far away. I don't know. Or somewhere like Hawaii, like somewhere really beachy and fun. Insta or Twitter? Instagram. I don't really have many followers on Twitter and it's just kind of like I only have it to like I don't know because I feel like everyone has Twitter so I don't know I don't really use Twitter that often I use Instagram which you should follow me on both if you could only eat one food for the rest of your life what would it be I think it would be only one food okay I would say a strawberry and mango and yogurt smoothie because that is super healthy and it has a lot of foods. I would pick something like a grilled cheese or macaroni because those are like yum. But I, I think a smoothie, if I only could have one thing, I feel like a smoothie because that would keep me like alive. What type of phone do you have and what are your cases? So I have an iPhone 6S, this is my case right now. It's rose gold, I love it. So you know how like Apple slows down all the phones or whatever? Mine never slowed down, my sisters did. And my phone for some reason, didn't slow down. Now I'm bragging. I'm just saying like, isn't that weird? So everyone in my family had to get a new phone and my phone is fine. But I actually posted an iPhone case collection video so you guys can totally check that out. It'll be linked below or in the eye in the corner. So if you want to see my iPhone case collection, you can. Who do you dream to collab with on YouTube? Um, oh my gosh, there's so many people. I think either Shane Dawson or Miranda Sings because she's so funny. I feel like that'd just be really fun because she's so hilarious. I don't know. That'd be awesome and I totally would love to meet her. Do you still like Hamilton? And if you do, what's your favorite song? Of course I still like Hamilton. I'm seeing it in like a few weeks. <laughs> I'm so excited. When I on each other car, while she's alive we tell your story. Did you hear that thunder? I asked myself, what would you do if you had more time? The word in his kindness that he gives me what do you always want if he gives me more time. That's my favorite song. The next question is, what is your favorite makeup product? That's really hard. I love my toasted palette. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Okay, so my favorite palette is from It's My Ray Ray BH Cosmetics. I love this thing. I don't really wear eyeshadow a lot, but when I do, I wear this palette. It's so pretty. It's a face and contour and shadow palette. It's so nice. And then my other favorite product is the Exposed Highlighter from Tarte. This glows like, like the sun. Someone said, why are there rumors of your channel being taken down? I haven't heard any of those rumors, so I honestly don't know. It's not taken down. I'm filming a video right now, and I posted a video yesterday. So, I, I don't know. What is your favorite Starbucks drink? I always get a Grande Light Ice Vanilla Latte. It's so good. I love it because I don't like really sweet coffee because I love, I just love coffee, but I don't like not creamy coffee. So I like the vanilla ice latte because it's a little bit sweet, not too sweet, but it has a lot of creamer in it. So it's really creamy, but it's not sweet. So it's really nice. And then with the iced and then, mm. would you rather do gymnastics or dance? I would rather do dance. Oh my gosh, I totally meant to say gymnastics because I I took gymnastics when I was little for like a year. I didn't really like it, but I would much rather do that. And I'm already kind of flexible, so like it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be like too hard, I guess, to like start off. Oh, also, okay, so everyone has like a bad leg and I've been working so hard, stretching every day, and I can do the splits on my bad leg, <laughs> which is so cool. That was so random, but yeah. It, if you could be in any musical, what would it be? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'd be in Wicked because I think being Glinda would be like the best and I already know like all the songs. Favorite moment? 
Okay, uh, my favorite moment, I mean, obviously I've had a lot of good moments, but one of my favorites was when I walked down for my meet and greet and a bunch of people were like cheering. Like I had a meet and greet recently. It was around my birthday and it was phenomenal. It was so fun. Everyone was like cheering and I felt just so cool. <laughs> How do you feel about the hate of you acting too old for your age? So I get hate a lot for acting too old for my age because I'm only 12 and people think I act like 17, which I guess is true, but people think I'm like doing it to be like, cool so I don't know I just kind of learned to suck it up but um it is annoying because it's like obviously I'm not trying to act like anything I'm just literally just vlogging my life and just talking to you guys of like how I would talk to any of my friends any of my friends would tell you I'm an old soul I'm just older I'm just older mentally <laughs> so I act I act more mature but I am like I still am a kid it's not like I act really really old like I still do fun kid stuff I still jump on the trampoline and like you know have play dates and stuff like I'm still a kid but yeah I get those comments a lot of saying like wow you act too old for your age but I'm just like cool I know I just don't see why people leave hate like I don't know I could never ever imagine like watching someone's video and like commenting something rude I feel like I would I don't know that's just so weird and if you're a hater and you want to comment something mean, would you think yourself to yourself, would you ever ask that in real life? Like, because I don't think, I don't think you would. Imagine how amazing it would be if there was no negativity and no one put hate comments. Like, that's all you have to do. If you're watching this and you've ever left, left a hate comment on anyone, anyone at all, think, if I just don't leave hate comments, then the world would be better like I don't know isn't it so simple all you have to do is not say anything <laughs> if you have nothing nice to say don't say anything at all and that is it for this Q&A the shout out of the day goes to Casey LDC I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog it was just kind of like a like a chill day you know thank you Casey for writing me a very very long comment on my Instagram that was so so sweet I will see you guys in my next video Yo. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see y'all tomorrow. Also, if you can see my leg popping up, it's because I'm sitting like this. <laughs> Bye!